been a long day today, but guess what? I got something to show you. Freaking right I do. Let's see what we can get into with Life with Bilsif's YouTube channel. Welcome Life with Bilsif, I'm your host Bilsif. Well, I got something else in for the LS today, and I always want to make sure I show you do, guys, because that's what I freaking do, right? Don't forget to subscribe, like, hit the notification bell bar button if you like to see new stuff coming in for the LS all the time. What? What do you think that is, Jim? Hey, leave a comment down below. Does that look like a steam vent kit? Freaking right it does. I think I just steam vented myself, I did. I'm gonna put on my daughter's shoes here because they're all cocked over. And all I have is my work boots. So check out them. Don't get jealous. These are going, just so you know. So stick around for that. We're gonna get rid of these things. And I'll show you what I'm gonna do there. But that's not right now. This is right now. Let's get the intake off. And we'll take a gander at these and see how they look. We'll just kind of mock them up tonight because it's already like quarter to nine and I'm not really in bed right now. I'm old, Jim. Oh, oh, oh. So we'll put this intake over here somewhere. Somewhere safe. Does that look safe? Maybe not, eh? Here, you stay here for a second. We'll put this somewhere safer. I've already got silicone on my intake too, which I can figure out how to clean that stuff. So there we go. That's better. All right, so steam vent kit, Jim, you stay down here and then we'll uh, get it out. We have one tube, we have, uh, oh, it poked a hole, it did. Two long ones, one's for the block, as you can see, because it's got a little, a little doodad on it. We get another little one. They're nice too, eh? Got a really nice screw job on them. Friggin' right, I should probably, uh, maybe tape up these holes here so nothing falls into them intakes. But let's just be careful. It'll make sure we don't drop anything in there. And I'll check them all before I put the intake on with a freaking flashlight, Captain. But let's go over here because I don't want to drop these in the intake I just talked about. I'll dump these out on decent. What do you think of my seat, by the way? Hey, thanks, Rob Ma. Why wouldn't you, bud? It comes with a corner pieces. So we got four of them. We should. Yep, four of them. And it comes with the T's. And it comes with four of them tees. It does come with the old rings. I was worried about that, but they're there. They're pretty nice looking little thingy my bobber. So we'll go back over here. We'll slap one on. Right there. Oh yeah. Friggin' right we did. So we'll slap that screw in. We'll get it to get an Allen key itch. You know what's really nice about this? That doesn't fit. It's kinda nice getting in like little parts at a time here. Cause that way you can tinker. Nothing like a good tinker job. So we'll slap this on here. You watching? Probably not. There we go, and we'll give it a little tighten job. I think that should be good right there. You know what we should maybe do with that? Let's take that back out and maybe put some Loctite in there. I think they're Loctite these, Jim, because I don't want them to come out. I don't. So we'll get my Loctite, where the hell to put it. Here it is. Glad to see I put the lid on right. So we'll get a little bit of Loctite on here. Not much, just a little. There we go. Stick that back in the hole and we'll give the old crank job. Having second thoughts of running this uh, water pump too, I'm thinking about going to an electric pump. It's up in the air, I'm not sure yet. You'll see down the road, so stay right, stick around for that. But there we go, we got that one in, so we'll give that a little tight job. Feels good. We'll get the other one, make sure the O-ring's on there, sure is. So we'll slap that on there, and we'll, uh, a little Loctite action. There we go, stick that on there. Bring her down to a tightness, there we go. We'll spin you around, grab another one, make sure the O-ring's on there, slap that on there, a little Loctite action, tighten her down, snug her up, feels good, next, move these hoses out of the way so you can see what's really going on, grab the last one, and we'll cock slap this thing right in your mouth, that sounded horrible, it's too bad but that's the way she goes, that's the way she freaking goes, don't forget to subscribe and like it and hit the notification bell if you like this kind of stuff. Well, there you go. There's all four corners on. Looks good. Looks really good. Looks not too bad. And looks uh, not too bad. So there we go. So now what we need to do is we need to put on the lid on the Loctite for one. So we'll take this little baby out and we'll slap it on. Now I'm just going to put these on just finger tight because I'm not sure how these go yet to be honest with you. I don't know where they're going to go with the intake. So we'll just put these on like this. This here looks like... Uh, it's gonna have to go over the intake to me. This is the cheapest kit I could find on eBay. <laughs> Just so, you know. so we'll uh, we'll be able to see why it's cheaper. I can already tell why it's cheaper. Look at the size of this thing. It's really going on. <laughs> why are they up so high? Oh well, just what it is. It is. Figuring right, it is. 
I'm gonna have to get a picture out for this. Something doesn't look right, Captain. Actually, I think this one will have to go here. No, I can't be right. This is what I'm just mocking up. Let's put the intake back on for a minute and we'll see which way they look like they should go. Because I have no friggin' clue. Leave a comment down below if you've done this before. It's clear where they are right now. Oh yeah, lots of room. So yeah, there's lots of room to run these things, I guess. So if this one goes out with the front, I don't like this up here, Captain. So we need to put one. So one goes down one side. What the f Yeah, I'm not, I'm not a fan here. Can we go down the middle? Is there enough room? I don't think so. Now there might be. Let's see if we can get down the intake here. So it will go down through the intake. Barely. I'm not liking it. I don't think I'm gonna go through the intake. If I had a high ram, sure. Low ram, no goody. Keep that in mind if you have yourself a low ram. You might have to go through this way. So that one goes to this one. I think I have something wrong here. I do have something wrong here. This one goes from front to back. So we could probably go down through here. I don't like that. Not even a little bit. Where's the other hoses? So this one's shorter. This one's gonna come off. Unfortunately, I have to say, this is not a very nice kit at all. It just looks half cocked over. That looks like shit. Like, what the f kind of fucking design is that? So the water sits all up here? Like, I mean, higher than a rat. How's that not gonna create an air pocket? What in the f? What a horrible fucking kit. I should send this back. That would work. I don't mind that. Because that's at the back of a block. You don't see that anyways. This fucking thing is way too fucking long. Can you shorten these things? This is ridiculous. Alright, I'm take this back off for a minute. We're gonna see if we can shorten these things. So it does look like we can shorten them. So that's what we're gonna have to do because that's unacceptable. And this is way too long to go from there to there. Like you need to shorten that up or something, but not the best kit. If you're in line for a vent kit, I'd probably stay away from this one. Cause now I'm gonna have to tape that up so I can get it back together. Probably cocked it over is what I've done. $190 cock over. It does thread on though, so we're pretty good that way. But I am gonna figure this out another night. Fucking me. I just wanna try something real quick before I hang up the phone with you. Woo! Not designed to take apart. Just so you know, we're almost there. Wow. What are you doing with my freaking doodads? Don't take that apart. Just saying. That was an absolute fucking nightmare. What a fucking joke. What a fucking piece of shit. All right, that's the worst steam vent kit I've ever seen in my life, even though it's the first one I've ever seen in my life. But if it's that awkward and that poorly designed to fit that shitty, then it's not worth two cents to me. Spend the extra money, get the good one that sits nice and low, because that one's garbage. Unless something changes from here until I get it on, and I'll let you know, of course. I'm gonna still with it. It's just, no, I'm not liking it. It's just kind of fing dickered, to be honest with you. It was $200 well spent. Not. Oh well. Hey, that's why I'm here, so you don't buy something I bought and it turns out it's garbage. Don't like it. Junk. Leave a link below so you don't get yourself one. Sorry about whoever sold this. You should sell better product because I'm not impressed by it at all. Or it shouldn't say, will not work with low RAM Holly intake or only works with certain intakes. I should have said something anyway. That's brutal. But we'll still play with it. We'll try to figure out what's going on. Leave any comments down below and let me know if you have any ideas or what you think. Or tell me if I'm just being an idiot and I'm doing something wrong. But there's just no way to make that kit look good, I'm pretty sure. Thanks for being here. Thanks for watching this episode. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe and like and hit the notification bell bar button. Until next time, love y'all. And you know what to do for now.